Weeds are problematic in our landscapes. They are aesthetically unpleasing, compete with our desirable plants for water. WPL Incorporated offers several quick guides on turf fertilization and weeds. Our weed guides will help you identify and control many of the most common weeds. All of this information, plus videos and other references, are also posted to our website at WPLawInc.com. Our customers are becoming very good at identifying grassy and broadleaf weeds. However, the one broadleaf that we get the most questions about is chamber bitters. Chamber bitter is also known as gripe weed, mini mimosa, and stonebreaker. This plant originated in Asia, but is now prevalent in South Carolina to Georgia through Texas. Medicinally, chamber bitters was used as a diuretic in the treatment of urinary disorders, including kidney stones, hence the name stonebreaker. It is a warm season broadleaf annual that looks like a miniature mimosa or fern. It is slender, typically greenish in color with a red stem. It also prefers moist, fertile soil. Now, one of the unique things about chamber bitters is that it has seeds on the underside of the stem and sometimes on the leaf. It typically spreads by these seeds. It also has a vigorous root system. Chamber bitters usually germinates when the soil temperature is 70 to 75 degrees, and this happens in early May. Now, left unattended, this plant can grow a couple of feet tall in naturalized areas and shrub borders, but it rarely attains a few inches in the lawn because of regular mowing. Now, be sure to check out another video we have about how to eliminate this weed from your lawn. As always, feel free to stop in to any of our locations across South Carolina for advice on lawn care. We can help you select the best products to make your lawn the best it can be.